Okay, everybody, hopefully you can hear this. Uh, okay, now uh, I know what you're saying. You're saying, gee, Eric, you have all the coolest plugins, you got all the coolest gizmos, you got massive, you got complete, you got operator, uh, all that kind of great stuff. But the problem is we don't, and we want to do all this cool base modulating stuff without buying VST plugins. So I got something for you. This is Crystal SoftSync or uh, Crystal VST. You can find it at greenoak.com, Crystal. And uh, if you just go to Green Oak, you're going to like see their iPad or I iPod application. You have to dig a little bit. You'll, you'll be able to find it here. Watch this, ready. Okay, here's Green Oak. You want to really find the plugin guide. You'll see Crystal Desktop. And here you wind up here. All right, about, you can download it. And another cool thing, it is for Windows and Mac, so you, anybody can follow along. All right, I'll get right into it. All right, so here is Crystal Soft Synth. I'm doing this inside of, uh, inside of Ableton, and I am running it through a compressor here just to be exciting. <laughs> So what is Crystal? Crystal is a three-voice, let's see, semi-modular, virtual analog, FM-enabled, wave sequencing, etc., etc. soft synth. It does lots and lots of cool stuff. It's free, so you can't complain about uh, any interface quirkiness and all that kind of stuff, uh, because free is free, and this is like free like it's in uh, free speech and free beer, I guess. Uh, you can't get the source code to it, but you can do some cool stuff with it. You've got uh, one, two, three, four, five main pages. You have a modulation page. You have a page for each of the voices, and you have a mixer page. I'm not going to go into the whole thing today. I'm just going to go into like a little bit of this, a little bit of that. All right. Voice one. Go to the voice one page. Set up a, an, each uh, voice has an oscillator. It has a filter. It has a VCA, an amplitude envelope. and that may seem really, really simple, but the envelopes are really complex. You can have up to nine segments. Each one you can like do all kinds of crazy stuff with. Now, right now we're hearing voice one, which is, in this case, it's already uh, being modulated. So I'll, I'll turn that off a little bit. Just uh, doesn't drive you crazy. Okay. Okay. Voice one is using a saw square wave. You'll have to look in the documentation, hear more about that. I can do some FM with it. Without FM. FM to grid it up a little bit. I can mess around with the pulse mix, pulse width, all the regular effects you expect to find, octave up and down, semitones, fine tuning, all that kind of great stuff. Portamento, etc., etc. So, simple saw wave, simple envelope, uh, simple filter. All right, so how do I get it to wobble? Go to modulation. You'll see here, this is one of the coolest things, this whole modulation page. You have six modulation envelopes and one, two, three, four, five, six, 12 uh, matrix points to kind of uh, cross modulate things. Uh, so, okay, we start off, we have a source and a target for modulation. I can take LFOs, there are six LFOs, there are six envelopes. Okay, uh, you'll see source, I have, here they are, six LFOs. Then I've got the six mod envelopes, plus I have all my MIDI controllers and stuff, so you can just like assign just about anything to anything. All right, I'm gonna start with LFO one. Over here, here's LFO one. LFO one is a square, uh, square oscillator. It's got lots of cool controls here. I don't have time to go into that right now, um, but mess around with it. I'm just doing something simple. Uh, we'll even do like a sine wave from zero to one. I'm gonna turn it on, you see? Whoop, 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 back and forth. Okay, that is modulating voice one pre-mixer level. So it's just volume right now. Okay. Now, what else can I do with it? LFO one, I'm going to also modulate voice two. Same thing, but opposite. See how cool that is? I can set a low and a high. So I'm crossing between the two oscillators. Voice one, or excuse me, the two voices. This has a slightly different, uh, different waveform setup. So I'm modulating back and forth between the two of those. All right. All right. Now, 
going to take LFO2, tons of these things, right? Square wave, LFO2 into voice to fil filter frequency. You guys are used to that kind of stuff, modulating filters. Right. Now I assign the mod wheel over on my keyboard. LFO rates. Muted. Duh. <laughs> LFO three. I'm modulating the voice, uh, the pulse width of, vo of voice three. Giving that whooshy kind of cool, pretty sound that uh, otherwise that square pulse. So real simple stuff. Uh, this is an incredibly deep synth, uh, especially for a free one. Um, I, I'm just you know a, a novice with it myself, but uh, it's worth checking it out. Uh, again, Crystal Soft thing synth. Boy, I get out of breath on these things. So give it a try, see what happens, let me know, uh, post your results, uh, comment to the video, see the thing on the bottom there, like it, subscribe it, whatever. Okay, thanks. See you later. Bye.